Hey everybody, Amy Schwam here from Women's Radical Pursuits. Happy 2021. How's it going for everybody? <laughs> Is everybody feeling a little bit lighter? A little bit more optimistic, hopefully? <laughs> it just feels good to have a blank slate ahead of us. Um, <clears throat> so today I'm just hopping on to talk a little bit about our... Um, upcoming journey starting on Monday, um, January 11th, um, New Year, New You, Return to Love and Light. So if you're curious about <clears throat> what this is, what it's about, and if you're, um, if you're needing or wanting or seeking, um, you know, just a, a, little, a little guidance on how to step into the new year um, more powerfully, more empowered, more connected to yourself and what you deeply desire and want to bring forth into 2021, then stay with me. Um, so the intention for um, the video today, I, I just wanted to talk about um, the return to love and light. What does that actually, what does that even mean? Um, and so I just wanted to um, kind of touch on that and a little bit more of the journey, but Returning to love and light is all about um, coming home to the truth of, of yourself. It's just coming home. It's it's like, it's wholeness, right? It's like that love and light is within you. It's in within me. And oftentimes through life, um, you know, there's, we, ha we have the clouds, right? Of just life, you know, and, and things that happen that kind of cloud that, that light, that cloud our love, that turn us away from love and towards, um, <clears throat> you know, fear and scarcity. It's like a, a cultural and societal conditioning. So really what this journey is about is just coming home to, the tr to that truth, to that wholeness, to what already lives inside of you that's just gotten a little bit clouded and covered up. <clears throat> and especially you know, after coming out of 2020 where, um, you know, everybody's had their own experiences, some, some really challenging, some other people really um, thrived in 2020, which is so wonderful. And, you know, it's just to say that we, we are all on our own journeys. It's just everybody has a different experience to, to have here in this life. And, um, and I really believe in, you know, divine timing and lessons and just, you know, um, we all process, we all move through life in a different way. So it's a very individual journey. 